What's going on, guys? It's your boy Iran Man GMG here for part three of the Fallout 4 playthrough. As you can see, we're still in front of the the building to go and help the settlement inside the museum of freedom. We're about to get in here and do this. I probably should say some of the grenades. But, you know, but it's cool. We have some Molotovs. We could definitely use those. Uh oh. Wait a minute. Oh, caught you, sir. Called him, sir. Let's get upstairs. Are you serious, man? You guys are really trying to play me. Got it. Uh-oh, got had killed one bird with two sounds. Sir, don't leave. Don't leave. <coughs> nice. <laughs> uh, you guys see how well placed that, can, that freaking mouse up was? Dude was not going. Upstairs, so you can kill these a holes. Ooh. Oh, you must want it too, huh? One shot to the dome. We'll take that stem back, but you keep everything else, my brother. Don't nobody else want no problems. Alright, give me a time to scavenge this place a little bit, see what I can take for myself. Uh oh. Cap stash. Spotted that with the quickness, yo. Man. Minute men? No. I'm traveling backward in time. Protect the people at a minute's notice. That was the idea. So I joined up, wanted to make a difference. And I did, but we went to the apart. Now it looks like I'm the last minute man. A month ago, there were 20 of us. Yesterday, there were eight. Now we're five. First, it was the Bulls in Lexington, and now this mess. Ghouls? What are ghouls? Wow. You really are from around here, are you? Ghouls are irradiated people. Just so you guys Most know, I do know what ghouls like you are. And me. I just they look pretty messed uh, up. Like if for anybody for time, who doesn't know who the ghoul is, here's the story. <laughs> the ones I'm talking about are different. The radiations rotted their brains, made them feral. They'll rip you apart just as soon as look at you. Anyway, we figured Conquer would be a safe place to settle. Those raiders proved us wrong. But 
Well, we do have one idea. One good idea can make all the difference. Sturgis, tell him. There's a crashed vertebrate up on the roof. Old school, pre-war. You might have seen it. Well, looks like one of its passengers left behind a seriously sweet goodie. We're talking a full suit of Cherry T-45 power armor. Military issue. I like it. I like it. <laughs> yeah, I thought you might. Protection with an added bonus. Get the suit. You can rip the minigun right off the vertebrae. Do that. No traders get an express ticket to hell. You dig? Minigun. Now we're talking. I know, right? Only there's one hitch. The suit's out of juice. Probably been dry for a hundred years. It can be powered up again. But we're a bit stuck. I'll help if I can. What you'll need is an old pre-war FC. A standardized fusion core. They're high-grade, long-term nuclear battery used by the military and some companies way back when. We know right where to find it. But we can't get to the damn thing. It's down in the basement, locked behind a security gate. Look, I fix stuff. I tinker. Bypassing security ain't exactly my forte. You could give it a shot. Actually, I already grabbed the fusion core. We're set. Well, all right. Maybe our luck's finally turning around. Once you jack the core into the power armor, you grab that minigun, those raiders will know they picked the wrong fight. Good luck. All right, people. Let's go give these raiders a one-way ticket to hell. Well, pick up the reception box again. Yes, sir. Are you listening to me? Ma'am. Now look who dog me brought to us. He's a good dog. Smart too. Oh indeed. Dog meat's good at finding folks who need him. And he'll stick by you now. I saw it. You saw it? It's the Kim's kid. They give old Mama Murphy the sight. In that way for as long as I can remember. That's incredible. I can see a bit of what was and what will be. And even what is right now. And right now, I can see there's something coming. On by the noise and the chaos. And yet, this angry. What is it? Mama Murphy, I need more, please. Oh, man. Sorry, Kim, but I just don't know. The sight ain't always clear. Believe me when I tell you, it ain't a raider. <sighs> I'm tired now. And if I ain't mistaken, you've got a job to do. Thanks for nothing, Mama Murphy. All right, guys. Let's get on out here and see what we can do.
This is so sweet. Up here. Boss! We got somebody up here! Oh snap, oh snap. Put me down, sir. I don't like being manhandled. Oh snap, he's about to slap me. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Take it to the face, yo. What's the outrageous one? So I want I want no problems. I don't want no smoke with me. Alright. I got a bullets. Gotta change up. <laughs> Alright, let's just go with the pistol. Destroyed everything out here. We are taking no L's. Let's head back inside the museum. Too many friends. Not in common. Though. Listen, when we first met, you asked about the Minutemen. One thing you should know about us, we help out our friends. So here, for everything you've done, thank you. Thank you, sir. Appreciate the generous contribution. You're welcome. Anytime. Well, since you say that, maybe you'll come to Sanctuary with us. We could use your help getting settled there. Sure. All right, Garvey. I'm in. Oh, that's wonderful. But there's more to your destiny, isn't there? I've seen it. And I know your pain. Destiny? My destiny? What do you mean? You're a man out of time. Out of hope. All's not lost. I can feel the sun's energy. He's alive. Where is my son? Where is Sean? Oh, I wish I knew, kid. I really do. But it's not like I can see your son. I can just feel his life force, his energy. He's out there. 
even I don't need the sight to tell you where you should start looking. The great green jewel of the Commonwealth. Diamond City. The biggest settlement around. Please, Mama Murphy, I'm working for nothing. I need more. Look, kid, I'm tired of it. Maybe you'll bring me some chems later. The site will paint a clearer picture. Mama Murphy, we talked about this. That jump is gonna kill you. Ah, oh, shush, Preston. We're all gonna die eventually. We're gonna need the site. And our new friend here, he's gonna need it too. So let's get going. Sanctuary awaits. All right, folks. Thanks to our friend here, it's safe to move out. We're heading for that place Mama Murphy knows about. Sanctuary. It's not far. She knows about it? You mean she had one of her visions while she was stoned out of her gourd? And now you want us to just head out on another wild goose chase based on no better plan than Mama Murphy's thought? You can oh, hold, hold on, on hold on. Then. Everybody just take it easy. We're all in this together, right? So Marcy, you got a better idea of what we should do next? Anybody? Well, sanctuary it is. Let's just hope it lives up to its name. Come on, Jill. It's time to go. Oh. Okay. Well, I guess I'll meet you guys at Sanctuary. Sure, not about to follow you guys there. Okay. Something is telling me I need to check. The saloon right here. I have a feeling this maybe some might not be the best loot, but maybe something I can use. Manage. See? Move the way, yeah. Finding a decent amount of caps. I told you I felt a good reason to come in here, you guys. So you're not gonna just get trapped. Alright. Okay guys, we're gonna go ahead and go to Sanctuary. We need to get in there. So far so good. So this is the workshop you guys. This is how you will be able to build your settlement the way you want it. Uh, but for the first couple of missions you will basically have to do some housework as far as getting everything your settlement needs. Food, water, different resources like that. Um, make sure they have beds and all that good stuff. But um, as far as right now. What is that? What is this? Right here. Okay. As far as right now, we're going to try to get some beds in, but I want to get rid of a lot of this rubble around the area. Just to beginning to start getting 
this place back in order. I plan on doing some things with this settlement, but I don't plan on doing a lot as far as my settlement. But if you guys would like me to, I would definitely try to do as much as you guys would like as far as getting my settlement up and running. Excuse me. I'm glad you decided to come with us. I should have listened to Mama Murphy all along. Pretty nice place she's found for us. I think we could settle down here. Make it a place to call home. What do you think? Yeah. I used to like living here. Before the war. What do you mean? Before what war? Are you saying... I lived here over 200 years ago. I was frozen or something for most of it. Damn. Like one of those old... You say you were frozen. Anybody else make it out with you? My son. Somebody took him away while I was still trapped. I was looking for him. Damn. Sorry. I hope you find him. Let me know if there's any way I can help. Anyway, I am glad you're here. I hope you don't mind, but I've got another favor to ask. I've had word from a settlement asking for help. They're still hoping they're the only chance to start rebuilding the minute. The trouble is, I've got my hands pulled in. Do you think you could go help out with the settlement? I'd be glad to help. That's fantastic. The minute men could use more people like you. By the way, if you want to help out around here at all, talk to Sturgis. I'm sure he'd be glad for all the help he can get. There we go, people. We have finished the quest with Free of Calls. Going to be starting the next one. Um, depending on 
what we do next episode, probably we get ready to travel to either the Jewel of the Commonwealth, or we're going to do a couple of the missions to help these settlements that um, Chris, Preston was telling us about. But if you guys are enjoying the gameplay, the walkthrough, please don't forget to hit that subscribe button, man, for more episodes to come. And if you guys are continuing to you know enjoy the gameplay as you will, hit the like button as well. This is your boy.